I literally froze in fear with that. <laughs> no! No! Two nerds play Resident Evil. Okay, so we're back. How's it going, everybody? Alright, so we're back. We're locked in this room, and I'm pretty sure this is the old classic take the shotgun out of his hands and the and door closes. And that's exactly what it is. So I have to find something else to put in his hands so that my shotgun can come with me. All right. So buddy, I haven't seen you in a couple weeks, it seems like. How's about, it been? About a week. About a um, week. Been going good, I guess. Well, tell um, me what's, what's been going on here. Nothing, just been working. Oh my God! <laughs> what's been Holy going? Jesus, it's <laughs> fucking... Fucking granny out here. Oh my God. God. Okay, I don't want to go near that shit. This is unsafe. This is just unsafe. Is... If you have children in the house, they could just easily... Yeah, totally. Okay. So what's been up with you? So, nothing. I've just been uh, kind of... Uh-oh. Eveline. Mm. May 2nd, 2014. That was two years ago. How was, tw how was your 2014, buddy? Was that a good year for you? I mean, I graduated college that year, so it was a decent year, I guess. <clears throat> excellent, excellent year. Excellent, excellent. When did you start dating Emily? Well, about 2014, towards oh, the end. There you go, there yeah, you go. Yeah, there you great go. Great year, great year. Maybe. Maybe. <laughs> Depends <laughs> how you look at it. Remains to be seen. <laughs> Where are my pliers? Did you lose them? Your bolt cutters or My whatever? bolt cutters, yeah. I don't know. Alright, so so check this out. What's gonna happen here is, is I'm gonna go try and open this door. This crazy old bitch is gonna grab my arm. Let's I do don't this. know. She's I don't she might not. She See she's not doing shit. Slash her. I can't. <laughs> Slash her! I can't. I can't! I can't do it. My morals won't let me. They okay. really like football in this family. I know, they got That's... fucking bobbleheads all over. Maybe it's daddy's hobby. Oh, man. Is there anything inside the helmet? There's nothing. See, now I have to like... I love how it's a Browns helmet. Well, yeah. Browns have a huge fan base in Louisiana. So, so now we're outside and we're on like the balcony. Okay. Okay, that was a noise. That was definitely a noise. Something is going on. So we hope you guys have been enjoying these Let's Plays. Um, if you have any other games you want us to play, let us know in the comments. Um, we hope to be doing another episode of Lost on VHS and start our podcast up soon once the Dynamite Palace Studios is back up and running. Or a rendition of it. Marguerite! Please move that shitty piece of shit hit... Move that... Piece of shit hippie we cut from the hall to the processing area. I don't know, Margaret just seemed kind of like a... Alright, so we got more... Oh, oh my god. Shit. Mia lost on VHS. Let me look for some items first. Gunpowder. A book. Can I open the book? Yeah. Yes. There, there we go. That's one of the heads. Blue dog. How much inventory is that taking? That's, oh my god, I have no fucking inventory, so what I'm gonna do is, all right, why don't you take this one, buddy? What do you got here? <clears throat> the reports say a storms are coming. <laughs> I had a lot of trouble cleaning up after the last one a few years back. I guess it's time to reinforce the windows and, what's this? Shore up, Shore up the roof. Shore up the roof. Maybe I'll get Lucas to help. Who's Lucas? Uh, isn't he like Ness's little brother or friend? Wasn't he the 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 dude the, at the table? He was kind of the equivalent of Chop Top, but without the uh, yeah. Chop Top. Right. Perhaps. That might be him. He just acted crazy like Chop Top did. Anyways, go on. The water has finally receded. You a sore throat there. <laughs> the house is alright, but the old house is... Badly damaged. Don't touch my leg. <laughs> Buddy's touching my leg. Lucas is making a fuss <laughs> about a huge ship that's washed up a in the huge washed, ship. Washed up in the bayou. 
If that's true, I better report to the parish. I'll go out and get it tomorrow. You know. Yeah, I'll go check it out tomorrow. Yeah, I'll go, I'll go, check, I'll go it check it out tomorrow. I'm not real worried about it right now. Oh, tomorrow look sounds at this. good. Ooh. There's a statue here. Is that wind? It's the wind. We got like a fucking buffalo head taxidermy over there. Ooh, wee. Yeah, that's. Mm. Oh my god. Whew. All right. <laughs> okay, you just take the hat right off the fucking wall. It looks like look, 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 they did a good job. If they I, I believe so. Oh, there's, there's a definite markings here, so that's why he's saying that the family did it himself, themselves. All right. I'm going to proceed to this area, get an antique coin, slash another Tom Brady. Congratulations, you fucker. Got some board games. There we go. Is there a fondling, a, a, a is there bronze, a fondling option here? Bronze tits. I don't right. think there's a fondling option. No fondling option. Let's go. Was that the last room? No, but I'm here? going back to put the Cerberus head in. Okay. Well, that was only one of them. Oh, yeah. Well, you may as well find one. Of them. Yeah, well, I, look how much inventory yeah. I have. I get to check my watch when I check my inventory, too. Then it shows me how scared I am. <laughs> Does it? Oh, well, it's got my heart rate on there. Uh -huh. Whatever that is. I would also like to take this time to formally apologize. <laughs> In the first episode, and I didn't even realize that I said it until I watched back the first episode, I said that The Raven was by Stephen King. Yeah. It's obviously by Edgar Allan Poe. I know that. Fucking idiot. So, I I know that, but buddy, I know I know it's my Edgar Allan Poe. Where's he's the had, he's had a couple weeks to look this up on the internet, <laughs> so now he knows. All right, I discovered that it was by Edgar Allan Poe because I tried to look up The Raven by Stephen King. So or, I don't know, I'm sure Stephen King has written something with ravens in it. No, there's no way. He's how many books has he written? Hundreds. He's written like a couple books. Couple, like yeah. one or two. He wrote it. Ma maybe a trilogy. He wrote it. He also wrote um, Hellraiser. I know it's by Clive Barker. Okay. <laughs> I think it's a comp? short. I think it's a short story yeah, by it's like, Clive it's like Barker. Like a novella. Yeah. All right. That door's locked. Right, let's see. Speaking of Hellraiser. Oh, I, I could double fist my knife. <laughs> oh yeah. The stab, the stab. You know the one, uh, the one from Hellraiser, not Pinhead, but the one with like the jacked up teeth, like the Chatterbox. Chatterbox, yeah. I've recently become acquainted with him, and he might want to do something at some point, just as an FYI. Do something? Yeah. You've become acquainted with Chatterbox. Yes. The Chatterbox. He, he does, he does a a podcast called Chattering. Okay. And All right. So, is this real? No, or? this is real. I'm not, I'm not fucking with you. Not fucking with you at all. Oh, wait, okay, so are we talking about the actor that portrayed yes. Chatterbox yes. and you're actually acquainted with him? Yes. Not. I'm serious. Not I'm serious. Uh, Hulk Hogan doll. I never no. said that. I never said that. That was the real Hulk Hogan that we had on this show. Hollywood Hulkster that we had on this show. Of course, you know that. You saw the episode. Yeah. If you're still with us here. But no, like I've act I, we've been talking through email, and when a certain project of mine comes out, he might want to do an interview about it. But we'll see. A certain project? When my movie comes out. What movie? My only movie. Unfriended? Yeah, unfri I made Unfriended. You I was almost positive you directed Unfriended. We did it all in my bedroom, <laughs> on my laptop. Was it that, were they using a Mac in that movie? I think so. Okay. Well, it was all on, like, Skype. <coughs> like you can use movie. Skype on Windows, you fucking idiot. No, that's not what I'm saying. I'm just saying the okay. whole movie is on a computer screen. Oh, get that. Those antique coins better be worth a lot because I'm reaching in fucking toilets <laughs> and shit to grab fucking. them. All right, let's see here. Um, I already checked this drawer. Okay. I'm sorry I'm doing a lot of exploring we here. Gotta it's find just kind of the way that I play the play these games. We gotta find those two heads. Cam fluid, baby! No, All right. Don't fucking waste it this time. Just... Next time you see me kind of fidgeting with the controller, remind me that L1 is the healing, the chem fluid. 
Okay. We got there's a toolbox. Okay. Um just really checking this area out before I uh What the fuck? Is it locked? Is that what X does? Okay. Flashes it. I'm gonna regret this later. <laughs> okay, that did not work. Alright. Let's go. Can I stab it? <laughs> I mean, you can. It's not gonna do anything. So I need a key for the toolbox. So Even there's though gotta be someone some... that was crafty enough could probably pick that lock with a knife. For sure. Alright. That's not me, though. I've never picked a lock. I've tried. You ever tried picking a lock? I've never tried picking a lock. There's another gun! Where? Right there. So... And is that room locked? That room is locked, yes. See this? Looks like your simple ordinary padlock, but... You got the pool table. You ever play pool? I've dabbled in some pool. Good. I was never a champion or anything. No. I was never cool enough to be in a league. Very few can be a champion like me. Alright, so let's go watch Mia's tape. How much time do we have? Uh, let's pause and watch Mia's tape. So when we get back, we're gonna do Lost on VHS Resident Evil Round 2. Make sure to subscribe for new videos every week. <laughs> <laughs> Subscribe. <laughs>